Hey there, everybody. Dusty Johnson from South Dakota. I obviously want to thank you guys for the incredible, responsible work you do. We know that we have our work cut out. Of course, we want to be good stewards of the environment. Uh, I think we're all called to do that. We need to make sure we do that in a responsible way. And we got the federal government standing in the way of making that happen. But the good news is I think there is some bipartisan momentum uh, making progress, uh, particularly uh, related to siting. And you all are experts, uh, and you, want, you realize that we're going to need to streamline the siting process if we're going to really unlock America's clean energy future in a lot of different ways. Certainly from a high-voltage transmission line perspective, that's really important. We also need to make sure that we're doing a better job of mining some of these critical minerals. We have made it almost impossible to site a new mine of almost any kind in this country. And that means that we are increasingly reliant on China for some of these critical minerals. And again, you all are more experts than I am, so you realize that the rare earth minerals aren't actually rare at all. They're located just about everywhere, but in low concentrations. And so uh, we can have mining operations in America that develop, that find those minerals so that we can have battery solutions. Uh, here in this country, so that we're not more reliant on China in the future than we have been on the Middle East in the past. So we've got our work cut out for us. I do know this is an area where the White House and uh, Speaker McCarthy agree that we do need to make it easier to develop big projects in this country. If we fail to do that, we will not be in charge of the global future of clean energy. We are going to be, uh, we, we'll, we will continue to be reliant on others who maybe uh, their values aren't quite the same as ours. So uh, you, you will find me a reliable ally in those areas. Uh, I have been going back all the way to 15 years ago when I was a state energy regulator, and I understood the need to have a, a long-term plan uh, for transmission lines so that we can get uh, the places that are, are best positioned to generate that renewable energy uh, to the markets where uh, th there is the greatest demand for it. This stuff requires some planning. It requires working together. I know you guys have been on the forefront of that for a long time, and I'm happy to be a part of the team as well. Thanks.